in mere seconds. It was the most horrific thing I've ever seen. The morning rush in Clarendon Hills halted by a fiery crash. And the thing just exploded. I mean, there was like a fireball and it threw the thing into the uh, into the parking lot. Witnesses describing a semi box truck stopped on the tracks at the Prospect Avenue crossing just as a metro train was fast approaching. All of a sudden, I just thought the three guys in the truck just jump out as fast as they can and then two seconds later the train just hit it head on. Authorities say a woman who was on this train died in the crash as two other passengers and two BNSF employees sustained minor injuries. Service was back running tonight, though limited, after being shut down for several hours. This as crowds were seen growing in Chicago's Union Station due to the sudden schedule change. NTSB now heading the investigation, trying to figure out what happened. The cab car which was leading the train would have a, a front-facing camera on it, and that will be downloaded. People who work nearby say they believe ongoing construction at the train site could have stalled the truck on the tracks before that fatal collision. As a delivery driver, I go over this like 30 to 50 times every day, so it's a nightmare. I hate it. I'm like, when are they going to finish this? As long as it's going to be like this, I don't know for how long, everybody's just going to have to watch out and be careful and just take their time. It's sad. This whole day has been really strange and sad. Metro officials say this line will run on a Saturday schedule for tomorrow, but this Clarendon Hills stop will remain closed at least through Thursday as this investigation continues. All local trains will not stop here at this crossing and delays are expected near this site. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC 7 Chicago YouTube channel.